Well, hello, my fabulous friends. I hope you're doing well. Wow, I've got the pulp tarot back on the table. It's been months and months. And of course, that means we're going to be talking about the Wicked Witch of the West. And I'm going to ask the cards, how is her new podcast going to go? And that's why I have Pulp Fiction there, because we all know it's all going to be fiction. Um, so is it going to be, you know what, let's give the girl a break. You know, I love listening to boring podcasts to fall when I can't fall asleep, right? You can't fall asleep. You put on a boring podcast. You know, even a broken clock is right twice a day. So let's 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 catch her a break. Maybe she'll become the most boring podcast, and uh, many people will, it will cure uh, insomnia like you've never seen before, right? Hope springs eternal. Now, how is? I mean. How is the podcast going to go? I want you guys to remember, she's not being paid for this podcast. Not like Spotify paid her to, to, to do a podcast, like how they pay Joe Rogan to do a podcast. No, this is a distribution. She has to find sponsors. And as I read before when I did the twig, that she can't find people to sponsor things for her. And uh, if she does, she find they find out very quickly that it was the wrong move. Uh, so maybe she'll get that, you know, that mushroom dirt coffee company or, um, and we all know what mushroom dirt is, don't we? Um, I don't have to explain that, do I? <laughs> the mushroom dirt coffee company. Um, manure, in case you didn't know. Um, <laughs> uh Maybe them. Um, um, yeah, I'm trying to blank. <laughs> oh, probably Invictus. They'll probably scam Invictus out of hundreds of thousands of dollars, uh, you know, for her to do interview athletes or something. But it won't be about the athlete. It'll be all about her and about how she knows how to hop on one foot kind of thing. Oh, Six of Cups. Yeah, you know what? Um, she's going to dig deep into her past and it's going to be a lot about her childhood and her upbringing as a poor black child growing up in the Comptons. Um, yeah, it's going to be about her past and about how her past has made her what she is today. Uh, might be a little bit about, um, her mother's side of the family because she dare not speak about the the Caucasian side of her family uh so it might be about about that side of the family might be with, with friends that she grew up with um yeah it's going to be about her about her childhood maybe about how getting over your childhood when your mom's in prison I don't know okay so let's ask the cards how is that podcast going to go? Is it going to be successful? It's going to be a flop. What's it going to be? Five of swords in upright. Well, you know what? It's a win-lose proposition. Um, she might use this to attack people who are who can't defend themselves. So maybe people who have already passed for example, or people who don't talk to her anymore. I think she's going to use this platform to attack people who can't defend themselves. Page of Cups. The star in reverse. Well, it's a Diana, of course. Of course there's going to be stories about Diana. Of course there is. Of course. If you're new here, welcome. If you've been here with me for a while, you know the star is my Diana card. She was a star and she lives in the stars. And um, I think we're going to hear some surprising stories about Diana. Maybe we're going to hear surprising stories about who's, who's the father of Diana's children. Oh, did I say that out loud? Um, seven of Swords upright. Yeah, she's got a strategy to... Uh, there'll be lots of lies, lots of... Uh, um, fluff, lots of my truth stories, queen of wands. It's going to be all about her. It's going to be all about her. And it's like the six of cups showed up. It's going to be about her past. It's going to be about her relationship with Diana. It's going to be her attacking other people. It's going to be her lying about other people. She's going to be her making up stories about herself. It's going to be her 
thinking, um, you know, making her the star, making her Diana point two, merching 100%. Two of Pentacles is my merching card, buy, sell, buy, sell, buy, sell. And about her yachting days, maybe, if you look, there's some beautiful yachts on there. Um, how, about how she bought and sold on the high seas. Two of Swords in reverse. You know what? She's going to be really stubborn about getting her way. And it's going to be her way or no way. Um, it, she won't even consider choices. Her mind's made up what the podcast is going to look like. The higher fan, she's going to, oh, she's going to be slamming the royal family. You can put your money on it. You can put your money on it now. She is going to be slamming the royal family, getting digs as much as she can. As much every little minute she can make a dig or get a dig in, she's going to be slamming the royal family. Seven of Cups. It's going to be all gaslighting. It's all going to be illusion and confusion. And, you know, it, we're going to look at that at a, at a brain, a mental brain of mental illness. And that's what my sources are telling me. Um, this is a um, uh, this isn't like a physical brain injury, like a concussion or anything like this. This is emotional brain injury because cups are emotion. Um, this is be having like racing brain and and confusion, and you can't stick to one thing. So it'll be one week bashing the royals. Next week she'll be talking about you know uh, grade two. The week after that, it'll be bashing the royals. The week after that, it'll be, you know, uh, you know her $44,000 pair of shoes that she's wearing. It's going to be all over the place. It's going to be all over the place. Six of swords in reverse. Yeah. You know, she's just going to create more, 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 and more stress. Uh, this will be very stressful to the royal family. Very stressful. This isn't going to be peaceful at all to the royal family. Not only is it going to be gaslighting and lies and confusion and, um, uh, it, you know, the inside the workings of an emotionally, mentally unstable person. Well, that's what my sources are saying. It's going to create a lot of um, choppy waters for the royal family. And I think she knows that. Six of Cups showed up again. So there, yeah. It's going to be her time in the royal family. It's going to be, it's going to be about her past. There's nothing future forward about this podcast whatsoever. Like future would be eight of wands, for example, um, or you know some pages with messages for the future. Now, no, no, no. This is going to be typical, typical Megan sticking swords in people's backs, making herself look good. Everybody else is an idiot. And rehashing the past, rehashing the past, rehashing the past. But in her viewpoint, in her demented viewpoint, uh, she's going to try and merch a lot of this stuff. There's going to be buying, selling, buying, selling. Um, let's see. Oh, social justice warrior. There she is. This isn't going to be a fair fight at all. This is not going to be a fair fight at all. This is going to be about her and racism and justice, social justice warrior, burning down the house. Here's Harry the Hermie. Hi, Harry the Hermie. King of Wands. Oh, Ari. This is Ari. This is this is uh, WWF. And, and for those of you, before you correct, I know you're typing right now. I just call them that because they're they're just as fake as the WWF. Um, five of Pentacles, Page of Swords. Here we go. The inter my here's my internet troll card. My internet troll card. <sighs> For some reason, and I please I don't understand it, and it's probably because I'm not emotionally mentally ill, and not that there's anything wrong with that. Um, you know, lots of people are. I don't understand how they think this is going to get them back into the royal family. Like, I seriously, there's something, there's like a chip missing or something. Because they want the five of pentacles here. This is for them to reestablish themselves um, uh, by being a troll, by being a social justice warrior troll, by burning down the house. Harry's on board with this. 
Don't you think for a minute he's not. There he is. He showed up right there. He showed up right there. He might even be the one who feeds some information. So there's Harry and there's Ari here, who's an Aries. So that's why he's the king of wands. Burn her down. That's that's the only job that uh, that WWF could get for for them is a job that how she's related to the royal family. The Ten of Pentacles is the royal family card. This is the legacy card. It's her connection to the royal family. That's all that people have interest in over her about. And about and and all the sugars will be how she can burn down, how she's going to bring justice to the royal family. Social justice warrior burning the place down. Right? And somehow they think they're going to win by doing that. Either they're going to get back into, they're going to become the royal family. They are going to become the royal family. And there's King Harold sitting on the throne. There's the Wicked Witch of the West out bonking some other billionaire. And there's Archie. And of course, there's no Lily. So see, this is perfect. This is perfect. Oh, look at that. Strength card in reverse. Yeah, this is going to be another flopples. They're going to, this, maybe it might last eight episodes. <laughs> and then they'll be looking at what else can they do. Um, they really hope this is a second chance, but it's not. It's the tower. It's the tower. This one, this, her trying to get back into the royal family or not even, I don't think, I'm going to back that up. I don't think they're trying to be, get back into the royal family. I think they're trying to become the royal family. They're trying to become the royal family. That's where the, the second chance is here in the judgment card. Um, it might last about maybe eight, because even this is an eight and eight. Might last about eight episodes before they decide uh, we need to change it up and, and give it a second chance. But it'll be too late. Here comes the tower. That's the hand of God. And look at even that's a hand of God coming out and giving you a smack saying, what the hell are you doing? I might have to edit that out for violence. Wow. So that's going to be the podcast. Let's ask the cards quickly. When are we going to see said podcast? When are we going to see? Oh, that was fast. Three. Three months. Yeah, I think we're going to see it in three months. So what's in three months? So we got March, April, May, June. What's in June? Trooping the color. Um, well, we got some birthdays in June. Maybe... Um, maybe she can put pump it out in three months. I mean, because I'm sure she doesn't have the same production and it's just her talking about her, which she can do for hours on end. But could it even be, could it even be three weeks? Will she try to promote it before we see Catherine? So is she going to try and upsert Catherine? I don't think so. I think we got three months here. I think we got three months. Well, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Oh, you know what? Yes, it will be three months because it's two ladies that own it plus it's two ladies that own it plus Megan. So they're probably bumping her to get uh, some just some to get some um, distribution going so they can get sponsors. That's the only way she gets paid. She's not getting paid by that lemonade. Um, they're just her distributors. She has to find sponsors. All right. Well, thank you very much for watching. I sure appreciate you. Someone's telling me to turn this one over. Eight of Swords in reverse. The victim. The victim. Somehow she feels like this will be her freedom. Being able to talk about whatever she wants. All right. Well, if you enjoyed this, please like, share, and subscribe. And uh, I sure appreciate you. I honestly do. My cup runneth over with my, with my uh, wonderful, fantastic viewers. Please take good care. See you online. Bye for now. <laughs>